J Chow part four out today. What another guys. part part four? We're missing everything. Coming All out today. Dude is running late. Where are you even going at this time of day? Where is that? Hurry up, man. J Chow part. So welcome back to the channel, everyone. This is so crazy. We have track number seven, and yeah, let's not waste no time. Let's get straight into it. Track number seven is called "I'm Not Worthy." I'm guessing this is gonna be one of the saddest songs in the whole world. I was playing chess with myself, sorry. Oh, I ruined it, I ruined it. Sorry, sorry. I ruined it, I ruined it, I ruined it. This is so sweet. This is just so sweet, but it's so sad. Can I just say this is so sweet, but it's so sad at the same time? But yeah, let's continue. Thank you. 
that was just crazy. Do you know what it is? I was listening to the song, I'm reading the lyrics, and I feel like he's just trying to teach everyone, like, listen, don't make the same mistakes as him. He let the girl go, he was being rude, neglected her, didn't give her the correct attention, now she left, she's still sad for him, and he's heartbroken, this is just so sad. You all heard the emotions he was singing in, you all heard the high pitch he went, and how he was having fun with the vocals at the end, it was just so sweet, and everything about that song. I feel like it was packaged perfectly like the beat was the beat wasn't too crazy the production wasn't crazy but it was good it was decent so the production then his vocals was just flowing on the beat and then i just feel like the, the lyrics put everything together the lyrics was like the glue because if i didn't read the lyrics i would have just said oh this is so sad but i feel like the lyrics makes me understand how sweet the situation is and how he ruined it so that's just so sad i'm gonna have to give that one I'm gonna have to give it a nine, solid nine. Actually, actually, because of the vocals, I'm gonna give it 9.4. Cause you know I like it when he goes up here with the vocals. I love it, it's my favorite part. So, that's just a sad song, man. I have to go back down. So far we've only had like two or three good, happy, crazy songs and the rest of them have been kind of sad, which is good. So yeah. And we have one more song today. Track number eight. Let's get straight into it, mate. So yeah, we have babbling. So I'm guessing they're just gonna babble and waffle and just chat a load of bollocks like me. Anyway, that's true. Why does no one knock anymore? Do you know what I noticed, yeah? 2021. None of my friends ever ring the doorbell. None of them ever knock. They just call me, yo, I'm outside, yo, yo. No one ever knocks. Crazy. True facts. Let's go. I was waiting for this song, I was waiting for it.
Oh, oh, it started again. I'm thinking that's the end of the song. That's crazy. I'm gonna give that one 10 out of 10 because he's roasting everyone. They're like, yeah. They're like, you're so good at babbling. He's like, yes, listen. You're just a fool. You're just a joke. He's roasting all of them. Forget all of them. Hey, he was going crazy. The production, the first five seconds, I was like, okay. Then I started bopping. I was getting into it. And I noticed in this album, he learned, well, he didn't learn. He started to layer his tracks a bit more. So while he's singing the chorus, in the background, you can hear him vocalizing. And it's nice. That's what I was listening to. I was like, ooh, ooh. But then, on top of that, so here's the, vo uh, the chorus. Then he's vocalizing. And then on top of that, he's got, he's going, what does he say? He was saying something. He was just like, he's having fun. It was just different. I could hear him like four different times. It was just crazy. It was a good experience. And I like it in the beginning part when they're just chatting. Him and Vincent Fang, I'm guessing. They're just talking. Oh yeah, what, whatever, whatever. And then they're just having fun. I love that. So I'm going to give that one, oh yeah, 10 out of 10. And as you can see, straight back up, mate. Ooh. So he was just going crazy. He's just basically roasting everyone. It was good. And he was talking about how people are rude. No one's got manners anymore. He's kind of, basically, I noticed he's teaching his audience. Like, listen, this is how you be gentleman. This is how you be like him. This is how you be good. So yeah, that song was crazy. 10 out of 10. Forget this. Forget all of that. Yeah. That was my favourite song of the album. So far, so good. We need more songs like that. So yeah, unfortunately, that's all we have time for today. But it's okay. We have the finale coming out tomorrow. And yeah, see you in the next video, mate.